Hi guys, welcome back. Um, if you're joining me for the first time, I am the Diamond Duchess. Sorry about my voice. It's very croaky at the moment. I've got a bit of cold. That's all it is. It's not the Rona. Um, I've got a couple of colouring books that I want to share with you. Um, just a flip through. I want to start doing a video once a week of colouring. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I'm going to lose this voice, I swear to God. Anyway, I thought I'd just do a quick flip through. So, these are Colouring Heaven books. Both of them. This one is a Dragon Special, issue 63. This one is Creatures of the Night. This one, there's 40 designs by er Dr. Ernest Drake. I'll get that right. Dr. Ernest Drake. He's a dragonologist. Um, right, can we see there? Yep. Righto. So in this book, I've started colouring. I've had this one for a little while. So I've started colouring this one. Um, and it just has dragons from all over the world. You know, as, as you do. Um, and it has a bit about the dragons on this side as well. I'll move that over a little bit so you can... There we are. So you can see. So we've got that one. So that one's an Australian one. That one is a giant lily dragon. Got your hummingbird dragon. If you're not into dragons, that's all right. And then you got your European dragons. Garden of Gold, a monkey dragon. Just making sure you're still in frame here. Your sea serpent. Chinese. Chinese dragons are very stand alone as you can you can tell the Chinese dragon. Korean, Korean Yong, apparently that one's called, and that one's called a cockatrice apparently, <laughs> oh I don't know, but I'm a dragon person, I'm a, I'm a mythological dark creatures sort of person, I like all this sort of stuff, Tasmanian dragon, Central Asia. So like I said, just a quick flip through, just to show you what's in the books. You can pause these at any time. Now I haven't done much colouring. What you've seen at the start of this book is all that I've done so far. Um, and that was quite some time ago that I started this, few few months back, it was last year. The dodo dragon. Looks like he's got a palm, palm, palm tree for a tail. Indonesian dragon. I didn't know they had wings, but anyway. Frost dragon. He's pretty cool looking. Apparently a phoenix dragon. Hydra. Which is your three-headed dragon. That's meant to be like a gargoyle-ish one. That's a very sad, depressed looking dragon. Japan. And we're coming to the end of it. And a Dragonsaurus Rex. And a Basilisk.
and then you've got your subscriptions and all that in there and on the back Righto, so there's the dragon one now this one is creatures of the night I actually have two diamond paintings that's what they're called um, from this lady so 40 exclusive dark designs by Sarah Ro Richter Richter? I'm going to say Richter. I'm very sorry if I got your name wrong. Um, I absolutely love her designs. They are just so awesome. So these are like um, angel fairy sort of aerial angel is that one. And then you got your aerial demon. Now I have this one in a diamond painting, absolutely beautiful, I have not done it yet but I am dying to start. You bat. This one's cute. Skip the page there. Your raven with your ribs and chest bones and roses and stuff. That's going to look really cool. She's going to be pretty. And dragon cross. So all of these are by Sarah Richter. Now, some of her, well, a lot of her work you can get in diamond paintings from, I think they've changed to Wellness Diamond Paintings UK now. They used to be, I love this with the unicorn, um, they used to be the Diamond Painting Factory UK. I'm pretty sure I've seen this and her work is licensed through the Diamond Painting Factory UK. This one is a diamond painting. I am yet to get this one but I really want to get it in the diamond painting. It's just absolutely beautiful. It's called Always Apparently. That's what it says over here. This one's also a diamond painting. In the diamond painting, she's all purple, I think it is. And I've seen this one as a diamond painting. A lot of them are diamond paintings, but they just look absolutely gorgeous. I don't think I've seen that as a diamond painting yet. This one's super cute. Got your little kitty cat and your bat and your little rat spider. This one's beautiful. He's very pretty. Johnny Thunderstorm. Kind of looks like Justin Bieber in a way. Like the eyes. I don't know. He just, to me, he looks like a mama's boy. Anybody else get that vibe? This one's cute, I love this. 
I used to have pet rats and I love rats. They make the best pets. Mine never had horns though. Mine was still cute. I apologise for sniffling, I can't help it, I'm a bit, a bit thick. Mother of dragons, I just love that dragon. I just love it. So cute. Now I'll bring this one up to you guys because it might be a bit, a bit dark. Sorry about the shadow. Can I get rid of that shadow there? No. I'll take it over to the side, baby. Reapers cats, all little kitties. So cute. I love that scarab beetle. I reckon he'd look good in purples and greens. And the Sphinx. Come on, two more. The bride. And last one is the glowing pumpkin. With the dragons and the pumpkin, and that's gonna be pretty cute. Right, right so that is Creatures of the Night Special. Um, they were, that one there was about $13 Australian um, and that one was the same. So they are both from Colouring Heaven. There you go. They are my two colouring books that I own at the moment. I don't know whether I'll be getting more, we'll see how the colouring videos go. Um, if I get a bit of interest I might grab some more and see how we go. Um, get some girly ones, get some cutesy animal ones or something, I don't know. So yeah, just thought I'd give you a flip through. Let me know what you think. Um, I will be doing a colouring page tomorrow, I'm hoping, if I'm feeling up to it. Um, if not tomorrow, Friday. So yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. I shall see you in the next one. Don't forget to hit that like button or subscribe. Um, keep you updated, all that good stuff. And I shall see you later. Thanks, guys. Bye.